for me, it was the park. I remember seeing the ad and at first the space was sold and then the agent came back and the deal hadn't worked out. I was just so thrilled because I always, I always wanted to live across the street from a park. So that was, uh, that was it for me and the space was great. Yeah, and it's a historic building too. We started the renovation after three years of living in the place. Before we even moved in, we had all kinds of ideas of exactly what we would do and where we would put everything. And by living here and testing things out a little bit, it actually worked out much better because when we moved in, we didn't really have the budget to start doing what we really wanted to do. So by having the time to stay in the place, get to know the place, get to know what we wanted out of it, we were able to really design something that worked much better for both of us. I'm a huge fan of Parisian apartment, Hollywood Regency too, so um, it's a mix of both style. The feel of the apartment was really, okay, let's, let's restore as much as possible, you know, the moldings, the restore or do it in a way that it looks exactly like what it would have looked like when the place was built, 1928. I love to collect furniture. This table is not our first table here. Uh, we started with, with yeah, so third Number one, <laughs> so we're doing swap. So we're, we're selling the, 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 the one we have and we're buying another one. It's all a work in process. I'm lucky because Carrie gave me all the... Uh, carte blanche. Yeah, carte blanche <laughs> and everything. So everybody say that it's, it's a manly place, but I think Carrie loves it a lot and she finds herself in it. I know that when he's choosing items, he's choosing them knowing I'm gonna like it. So I never feel left out, I never feel like I'm not at home here, but truthfully, I haven't had first choice on anything in this place. And it's okay, because I know he's thinking about me when he's choosing it, so it works out. <laughs> The place was designed to be easy to entertain. It's, it's meant to be easy to, to flow and to be easy to talk to everybody. It's a small bathroom, but we decided to put high-end fixture, and we put marble everywhere, and uh, what we call an Italian shower. It's like having a, a small car, but really luxurious, like everything in, in Europe. What is now the walk-in closet was a baby room before, but there are no windows. It's nice to have a three-bedroom house, but if you're not going to have windows in there, there's no point. We're quite both shoes collector, <laughs> and uh, we have a lot. You more than me. <laughs> <laughs> and we have uh, a lot of clothes, and so yeah, we, we, we need that space to store our things. Yeah, still missing space. Yeah. Believe it or not, <laughs> even with that big walk-in, we're still going like, where do we put everything? <laughs>